So my mom was asking me what a barracks room was like. And that's a little bit difficult to explain. So I think I will just go ahead and show everyone. Now, I don't live in the barracks. It's kind of temporary. Just want to have a course. So I don't have a ton of stuff here. But if I did, these beds are also called coffins because you can lift it up, store all your gear in there. And it locks, well, should lock. Speaking of the furniture, everything is incredibly heavy. It is metal and wood. Now you would think that makes it durable, right? You know, it's quality materials, but you would be wrong because every single piece of furniture in here is broken, all of it. It's broken, this chair, absolutely disgusting dirty and broken this one's bent and it was probably stolen from somewhere else because i don't think it belongs in here but whatever somebody left their lock this is all bent to heck but i have the room to myself so that's good i don't have to deal with other people so there's three desks three of everything three wall lockers desks beds but not three mattresses. Sucks if you're that guy. When, when was this made? There we go. 2009, so the 10 year warranty is up. Got an underwatted microwave with no plate in it whatsoever. But sometimes that's just life. For the bathroom, we got our mirror. Bathroom. Uh, I got my soap. If it's good enough for baby ducks, it's good enough for me. Then you have this vent up there, which perfectly transmits sound from the other rooms extremely well, I might add. So you can hear people in there yelling, fighting. Uh, doing your business, showering, or just lightly whispering. You can hear everything. Shower here, hot and cold. Had to definitely clean this because it was moldy. Uh, don't, don't worry about all that stuff. I went ahead and made some marks so that um, you, you know where to put the knob because if, if you go past this mark, you will get third degree burns all over your body. And if you don't go past that one, it's just ice cold. There's very narrow range. But even if you do have it in the right setting, it'll still uh, randomly burn you, just randomly, or freeze you. Kind of both, you get a mix of, of both. So like an average, it's normal. Cute little mini fridge. Well, I, I guess, not a mini fridge, but it's not a normal fridge either. For three people, the fridge kind of sucks. Uh, let's be honest. I've just been using it to meal prep, stuff from a cooler, food, food stuff, a lot of energy drinks, oat milk, the essentials. This one would start sparking. Then somebody had tape. <laughs> they were taping this open. And it is uh, clearly faulty. That's the danger outlet. Down this uh, creepy dark hall, we have our laundry room. So it does have Speed Queen appliances, which are among the best uh, for any washer dryer. But um, of course, Marines break them. Um, they're supposed to have like a 25 year warranty. <laughs> they break them like nothing. It's also a little moldy in here. I don't know if you can tell. Got some, uh, some reps. Well, what it is. Not too bad. 
Oh, we got paid for it, so. Somebody left some detergent. Can't complain. I hope you like the tour of my crib. It's been pretty all right, as they say. But I've got to get up at 5 a.m. and do a whole bunch of stuff again. Hopefully, everything goes all right. Till next time.